Hey everyone, so welcome back to another Fortnite Battle Royale video. So my plan for today is to do some Fortnite Mares quests, so let's get straight into it. So this is my first video of Fortnite Mares. It's been a couple days since it started now, but oh well, still I'm coming here to record the quest now. I've leveled up quite a bit since I last recorded. It's quite good. Almost level 100. Oh, we're already almost halfway through this season already, which time has flown by. Before you know it, it'll be chapter 3, season 5. Or chapter 4, season 1. Depends what. I, I personally think it's too early for chapter 4, but. There's leaks supporting Chapter 4, but I reckon what they'll do is have Chapter 3, Season 5 as like, once the Chrome engulfs the whole map, they'll have like, all the stuff that they've been lifting off as like a second map above this map, and in, in the same match you can go up and down between both maps, that would be cool, and I reckon maybe that's what they're going to do, I don't know. That's just my theory. So I still love this map. The chapter 3 maps. Almost perfect in my opinion. It's good for zero builds. It's just good. Like overall, most of the POI is good. It's great. Like, we've had lots of good collabs. This, this, so far in chapter 3. Just got another Dwayne Rock Johnson skin. I actually quite like. I don't really like the DC skins, most of them. But I like the uh, Black Adam. Which is quite cool. And we're going to Grim Gables. Which is the first time I'm showing it on camera as well. To replace Shifty Shafts, but in my opinion, I think Green Gable is better than Shifty Shafts. It's just so much better. I hate now that with Fortnite Mares, they've added like this dark mist around like the reality tree, Green Gables, and I think where was the other spot? Mm -hmm. I think that was it. Yeah, I think that was it. But still, it just makes everything harder to see. Yes, it gives Halloween vibes, but it's just annoying. Sometimes. Sometimes. Get that gun, get that gun. Oh, crap. Yeah, that zombie's dead. Oh, gosh darn it, got killed right off the bat. Oh my god, it killed one zombie and then I killed straight away. That's annoying. It's ready up. So I got one done. So I wonder. Two, four, six, seven. Yeah. So later tonight they'll add some more, but yeah, I'm not sure what they will be yet. People say the help defeat Inquisitor at Grim Gables is the hardest, but. I haven't tried it yet. And people say the new mythics are good, but I just haven't used them yet. From Nikkei 30s video, they do are quite overpowered when you're riding animals in builds and stuff, so. So yeah. And Ali A has showed showed it as well, so it's quite cool. A lot of the YouTubers have shown it, but in my opinion, so far this Fortnite Mares hasn't been as good as last year's in my opinion. Kind of lazy compared to last year's. I don't know, there hasn't been as much content. Scythe, the broom, nothing came back at the start of Fortnite Mares, which it really should have. And it would have made it better. So we would have had it around for longer. The same with Horde Rush, it should have come right at the start. not towards the middle of Fortnite Mares, that's just weird. 
But the bus was cool, I liked the bus. It's, I would say the birthday bus is still my favourite battle bus because it has that nice birthday music theme. I would say that's my favourite, but favourite design and look to it, I would say it's Halloween. I'd say those are my two favourite. Might be long before it's Winterfest. I, I actually quite like Winterfest. Last year's Winterfest was my first. And same with last year's Fortnite Mares, but still. People say it's quite good. Because I liked Winterfest, actually. Couldn't get enough of it. Oh, zombies! Done, zombies! Ah! Oh my god! God, I got to keep getting killed right off the bat. Let's try this again. Not get killed right off the bat, that's just annoying. I land, get killed right off the bat. I think maybe I need to land outside of Grim Gables. It's quite a hot drop, but. Let's ready up again. Uh, without dying. Right off the bat. But still, there's, there's way more milestones this season, which I don't, I don't really do focus much on milestones. Uh, there's a few that I'll grind out, like hit weak points and stuff, and spend bars. But the thing is, now if you're doing the spend bars, it's way harder because they've removed the gold overpowered gold spot from Chrome Crossroads, and now they've just filled up with Chrome Hexagon pillars and stuff, so. That good spot's no longer there for gold. So now the best way is just to get keys. But you're not always guaranteed keys. Unless if you kill the new Fortnite Mares boss over, I think, Willow. It's near the reality tree. And you get one guaranteed key, but there's no vaults around there, and then you've got to make it all your way over there. And it's weird, they've removed boats. Which is really weird. I don't know why they removed boats. I miss boats already, it was just that nice little thing to get around the waterways, so much easier, just miss boats. Don't know why they had to remove them. They're not that bad. Unless if they were glitched or something, but I don't remember it being glitched or anything. Looks like planes are coming back halfway through Fortnite Mares, which are good. I, I love planes. And the ones from Winterfest 2020, the ones that aren't overpowered. My first Winterfest. Actually, I've had experienced two Winterfests. And I have. Last year wasn't my first Winterfest. It, first Christmas event was the one with the Snow Mando skin and stuff. I still think the first, uh, I would say last year was the best winter fest. I like the new challenges and free rewards every day. Even though most of them were bad, the Snow Mando skin is still a pretty good Christmas skin. It's the best Christmas skin I've got. I only got a few, but. Oh, Polar Peel is good, but. It's just. I nah, still. <laughs> Snow Mando looks better. I don't see Snow Mandos much anymore. Yes, I used to see them everywhere and I used to play how often I'd see them, but now it's like, yeah, it's kind of of an underrated skin, but straight into the cornfield, not getting killed right off the bat again. I thought I was a player that came out at me, but no, it's a zombie. Player I'm gonna try and kill. There we go, they're dead. Killed them one. One shot to the head. Oh, 
zombie chickens are annoying. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video of me dying pretty much every single time right off the bat. I didn't really enjoy dying a lot, but at least I got one quest done. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya!